Climate change is happening and the world faces disaster if we don't act now to reverse the rise in temperatures caused by carbon emissions. There is no planet B. Wait, along with other leading built environment industry partners, is constantly looking for innovative energy saving solutions. We all have a part to play in making the many small changes that add up to a big impact. Waits has set some ambitious targets on its journey to achieve zero waste, zero carbon and zero harm. This video takes a look at some of the best practice examples from Waits projects around the UK. We're at the Lucent Project in Piccadilly Circus in the heart of London, tucked away behind the iconic Piccadilly lights. Since day one, the project's been designed by the client to have sustainability as a core tenant. We've got a Bream 2018 assessment for our building sustainability, a well assessment for our end building users' happiness, uh, an embodied carbon assessment tracking all our carbon emissions, and an FSC full project assessment tracking the sustainability of all of our timber. In an urban environment such as the centre of London, we're still looking to deliver a lot of natural enhancement. So we've got a green wall going in at the end of the project in the winter garden. We've got roof terraces with a number of green aspects to them. And we're looking to install a green roof on the residential fit out. We've approached a number of individuals on this project purely on their sustainable credentials. We've got a full-time environment manager to monitor our impacts and we've got a few subcontractors who are fully carbon neutral throughout their operations, including our scaffolders and our steel workers. Our steel work and a lot of the other elements of our project have a high percentage of recycled content to reduce their lifespan impact. And our concrete on the project has a high cement replacement product percentage, which really reduces the embodied carbon within it. New technologies such as portable devices and cloud-based systems are essential in delivering sustainably here. We can reduce our paper usage through things like field view, which allows us to see our risk assessments whilst we're on the go on site and reduces printing, and through BIM modelling, which is allowing us to deliver drawings and diagrams of the project without using paper. I'm really excited to be part of the Lucen project because it's an iconic landmark in the heart of London, and it's truly delivering some fantastic sustainability measures. Here at the Cardiff Living Passive House Scheme, we are building 42 homes for rent and low cost ownership for Cardiff Council. The homes have been built to Passive House standard and Passive House is low energy building standard. Passive House is a set of building principles designed to create very energy efficient homes. The homes will be very airtight, good thermal insulation and triple glazing and with heat recovery ventilation systems. Passive House is all about fabric of the building, air quality and the comfort of the residents. The buildings have been carefully planned out to ensure that the design requirements for thermal bridging and air permeability are met. The incorporation of all these standards means that these buildings will be very energy efficient with uh, low energy use. This is one of the largest Passive House projects we have done. We will also be monitoring the energy performance of these buildings once they're occupied and we are also undertaking whole life carbon assessments and circular economy assessments. This will be very important in meeting Waits' low carbon targets. Now we're just down the road at Eastern High, where we are delivering 214 houses and apartments in a joint partnership project with Cardiff Council. The project's designed to be net zero carbon ready, and we're also working in partnership with Zero Energy to incorporate low carbon technologies to deliver low energy housing and tackle fuel poverty. We're starting with a very good fabric performance. We're installing ground source heat pumps uh, on all the properties, which take heat from boreholes in, uh, in the ground to produce low carbon energy. Virtually every home on the scheme has photovoltaic panels. These will generate electricity for the homes and also gives us the option to import power back into the national grid. 
we are creating homes as power stations. Every house will have a battery which can store power. This can provide up to one megawatt of storage across the scheme, offset the equivalent of 600 tonnes of CO2. And this is in addition to any carbon reduction from the PV panels, which in themselves can generate up to half a megawatt of electricity. The data we're collecting on this scheme will also be a valuable benchmark and will be used on future schemes. Currently, we're anticipating that the homes on this scheme will be 95% more efficient than current building regulations. This is a huge achievement. We're here today at Wellington Place in the heart of Leeds. We're currently working on 11 and 12 Wellington Place, which is set to be the most sustainable building in New Yorkshire. We've thought a lot about the little changes we can make on site. So we have introduced a cycle storage um, to encourage people to ride their bikes to work. And we also have a pond on site, which is powered by a solar panel. We have a greenhouse where we grow various fruits and vegetables, and they're used by the on-site chef. We are looking at closed loop recycling, so all the floor protection on site gets recycled, um, sent back to the factory and distributed to other sites. We've got PV panels on site, which provide 22% of the energy for the site cabins. We're currently working towards Briam Outstanding. We're also working towards Neighbours UK ratings, which is about the ongoing measurement of carbon in the building. We are targeting net zero for embodied carbon and also net zero for the operational side. We had a consultation with the client and we introduced a lot of sustainable elements on this building. One of the main ones being reducing gas completely out of the building and doing that as a full electric solution building. We've done multiple other sustainable items on here. Uh, the big one being introducing the air source heat pumps. So again, in the ethos of the working as a full electric building, this is the most sustainable source that we can have for this type of development. This building is packed with smart technology. It includes lighting control, access control systems, QR, locker booking systems and visitor management. All of these combined will help drive the efficiency of the building. This is just a small snapshot of some of the work that Waits is doing to create more positive environmental impacts. It's work that will continue and evolve from individual actions to larger company-wide transformation and organisational changes. We all need to change our habits on the road to zero carbon. To find out more about what Waits is up to, how you can support their ambitions for a low carbon built environment, work with them or join them on their journey, visit Waits online.